The University of Texas at El Paso College of Engineering, in collaboration with Halliburton, presents Wind Turbine. Before using any machinery, make sure to wear the proper personal protective equipment. The wind lab represents an entirely self-contained portable wind turbine based electrical generation system that can be used indoors or outdoors. Air flows through the wind lab system in a left to right direction. The wind leaving the wind lab system can be traveling up to 7 meters per second. The operator panel of the wind turbine consists in a master power switch, a wind speed master controller, a generator excitation controller, a wind turbine RPM display, a wind speed display, and voltage and amperage display for phase A, B, and C. The generator rotor is the rotational element in that generator. It is designed with an electromagnetic core which requires excitation voltage to magnetize it. The DC excitation voltage is supplied by an adjustable onboard transformer with a maximum 18 voltage magnitude. It can be adjusted from 0 to 18 volts through the generator excitation voltage. A scale for cup wind anemometer is mounted on the wind turbine tower pole to provide accurate wind speed measurement as it affects the wind turbine. The wind fan is the controllable wind source which drives the wind lab turbine. It is driven by an electric motor which is controlled by variable frequency drive. The wind speed can be controlled manually by the operator. Before turning on the wind turbine, be sure that the three low rheostats are placed in their lowest resistive setting before wind start up. This allows the wind turbine to come up to a speed faster since rheostats are no loading systems. Also, make sure that the excitation voltage, which is the generator excitation, is turned at its lowest setting. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe.